What is good everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today I do have some new WWE figure images for you guys. We got brand new Elite images. We also have some updated looks at some of those other figures that we've seen in the past that I've talked about. But uh, let's go ahead and get started right here, guys. You can see first up we have new images of those new supposedly Survivor Series Elite figures. And these are legit. You can see here, now that we have better images of them, these are legit. You see Bobby Roode, Alexa Bliss, and AJ Styles. I still have no idea what these attires are supposed to be, at least for Alexa Bliss and AJ Styles. I don't know what they were thinking for these. I still like the look of the figures. I cannot wait to grab the full set and the there is apparently only three in the set. I thought there was four there are only three. There is no John Cena Elite or any other fourth Elite. Just these three in this set. But uh, I am liking the way they look. Again, the AJ Styles, I'm completely lost for words on where they got this you know, hoodie from or these kick pads and attire. I still don't know where that's from. But uh, that is it for this Survivor Series set. But they are legit and they are going to be coming out very, very soon. Next up, we have a Killian Dane Elite you can see here. I'm still not sure if this is going to be an NXT Elite or if this is going to be in the regular Elite line. If I had to guess, it'll probably be in the NXT line. But you can see here on the left, he is in without his gear. And then on the right, it is his entrance gear. It looks very nice. And if you take a closer look in the background, you may be able to see the new Scott Hall WrestleMania 35 Elite. And um, I can't wait to get that figure as well. Killian Dane looking good here, though. I like the parts choice for it. And it is a nice figure. Can't wait to get that one. It finally drops. Next up, we do have another NXT Elite. And it is the Roderick Strong. And we did not see that it was going to come with a jacket. But apparently it is. You can see here, guys, it does have his blue and black jacket. It's looking great. Um, I'm a huge fan of Roderick Strong. And I'm a huge fan of his work. So this is a must-get for me. I don't know, again, if this is going to be an NXT Elite. Or if this is going to be in the regular elite line again if i had to guess i think it would be in the nxt line i don't see this being in the regular elite line but i could be wrong um, but it is a nice figure you know we hadn't seen it with the jacket on there we didn't know exactly which accessories we were going to be getting but he is coming with his uh, jacket here and he does have a very nice head scan beautiful looking head scan um, if you're going to make this figure updated though you're probably going to have to do a torso swap because he's actually absolutely jacked right now he is looking better and better each week so um Next up, guys, we have an updated look at the brand new Titus O'Neil Elite figure here. You can see it's a prototype image. He does have his lime green trunks. He's got, you know, you can clearly see he's making the Titus pose. So uh, this figure does, you know, give you enough articulation to do that pose right there. But I feel like we're way overdue for a Titus O'Neil Elite. I am liking this figure a lot. Great head scan. I believe it's the same head scan we got with the primetime players. And uh, I guess we can recreate the, uh, the Titus World slide from the Greatest Royal Rumble with this figure so we can uh, I can't wait to see what people do with that um, but this figure is looking great maybe you could even make a Booker T in lime green or a Bobby Lashley in lime green if you wanted to do that out of this figure but we are finally getting Titus O'Neil and I think that it looks great the prototype image looks great here and it looked even better at comic-con so cannot wait to see when this finally drops but moving on, guys, next up, we do have a look at the brand new Cian Almas figure, and you can see we are getting the NXT Championship with this guy, as well as his entrance hat. You know, at Comic-Con, it did not display with the entrance hat, but we are getting the entrance hat as well, so I am very happy with that. I don't think that uh, we have seen that before. We have seen this mold, I'm pretty sure. I don't think it's a new molded hat, but... Uh, Seeing almost his first elite will be a nice one. We're going to get the NXT Championship and his entrance hat. Again, the uh, the final product image looked amazing at Comic-Con, so um, the product images here look pretty good as well. Moving on to the last figure for today, guys, I do have an image of this elite Aiden English, and look at that head scan. I mean, my goodness, like, he, he's two for two on his head scans. You know, his first head scan um, a couple years ago with the VOD Villains Battle Pack looked amazing, but this one looks even better. I think it, they updated it. It looks great, and if they do the true effects, I think it can even look even better. But um, I, I don't like the torso choice. You know, Aiden English is actually Jack. I think he deserves bigger arms and a bigger torso, so I'll probably be switching that out with an Elite Sheamus when I get this figure because Aiden English, you know, he works hard to keep his body right, and I'm not going to disrespect him here and give him this small uh, Daniel Bryan-style torso or CM Punk-style torso. I'm going to be updating that, give him the six-pack look because uh, he's absolutely jacked, and he deserves to look like it. So Aiden English will be getting that. You know, we don't know what attire it'll be. If I had to guess, it's probably, I doubt it's VOD Villains. I'm sure it's like when he broke away and went on his singles run. Possibly a Rusev Day attire. I think that'd be cool to see a Rusev Day attire, but I don't think, 
I don't know if it's soon enough. I guess it would be. Maybe we'll get that. Uh, that would be cool for me. I would like to see a Rusev Day attire, but I guess we won't know until we have more images and when that day comes. I will be showing you guys, but thank you guys so much for watching. That does it for all of the images I have for you guys today. Thank you guys so very much for watching. Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE figure videos. Follow me on Instagram at MyDamnToys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.